I marched with Dr. King 51 years ago in Selma, Alabama for the right to vote. And that was the crown jewel of his leadership. It was Mandela who came out of jail in South Africa about the right that was the crown jewel by democracy. But you have the right for early voting in Ohio, you don't have it in other states. There is a state control and suppression schemes. Uh, some deny Sunday voting, some deny early voting. The, the suppression scheme is significant. One reason for the other is she, she supports the protected right to vote. Uh, it's called is a suppression according to the law. Uh, Trump calls it uh, a foul. He calls it a freer foul. He is against the early voting. Uh, second, uh, she stands for raising workers' wages. Working poor people who have more money than money. For gender equality, women cannot buy bread and milk and a gas cheaper. Yet they cannot get fair equity. And so steps for economic justice for women is a big deal in our society. Uh, ending racial disparities. A uh, Supreme Court that looks like America. Uh, the Trump's administration will lead Clarence Thomas extended on the court. That's a backward step for America. Last thing to defend our Mexican neighbors. We share 2,000 miles of water with Mexico. That we, we will trade with Mexico and with Japan and China. These are our next door neighbors. We should not offend them. We ought to ban Muslims from our country. We need a, a new sense of living in America for the door and not for the old. So I would say that being in Ohio, this is a critical state. It's a battleground state. So those that have been in reason without the choice between Hillary and, and Trump, I think there's a substantial difference. We should choose the right side of history. Thank you.